Wagwan, 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 wadao Walio single Walio na watu Walio achwa Na wanao pendana Today Welcome to this episode on the bench I'm joined by my favorite kids Oh lord Obviously you know my son and my daughter in law <laughs> Yes truly You uh. introduce <laughs> Yeah Rona no, na pia nimekuwa nzipa kwa kofia hivi. You know how we are Yeah, like father like son. So you guys, welcome to the show. Sim salimi ya nasema hi. Hi guys. That's your, that's your camera. Oh, that's my camera. Yeah, that's your camera. Okay. Say hi. Hi. Eh, <laughs> introduce. My name is Nasieku hmm. and I'm a daughter in law. Yeah, wa gwan umpe makofi hapo mkieni tukamnyama elephant. Dear son. Oh, oh. Do it like I taught you. Eh. Tengo ni gani? Jume ni fukuza. Ni. Oh, good party people. This is boy just come Klaus. Co-hosting with our our fellow brother here. Party people. Mhm. Nani alikufunza hiyo sasa party people? Nitakuwa MC. Oh, na Google mefika hapo. Wagwana wagwana. Umeenda Dubai wewe? Na ni mimi. Umeona Google penye yako. Bro, mimi na mimi naenda na Google Dubai na Twitter. Kwaemba. Anyway. Leo tuko hapa mazi nimeleta watu wangu hapa because our guest of the day analeta tu vibe. Leo nataka tu tupige tu story. And like all the other shows that I've had, eh. Leo mimi atasijui. Personally tumejuana na huyu guest wetu wa leo for some time and his <laughs> true vibes nataka au watu mshaanza can i please have this plane in my show uh, this show is supposed to inspire people so anyway, inspire to, to fall in love i give them hope because in a post year karibu na 14th can it's in valentine happy valentine guys so stuck you couldn't make it is the month of love it is the month of love Basi ulikuwa tunaingia pale na ile one word. Na unajonge yeah. one word for them. One word guys. The one word goes like this. Are you ready? Namtulie bro. Ah. Na si yako. No ni guys. Let me just introduce guests. Haya. Uko ready? Haya. One word. Haya, one word. One word. So utanipea one utanipea hata si one word utanipea line moja from one of the song so kusema his or her song utanipea one phrase na yani pe one phrase yenye tatu tatu introduce na mkikosa mnanipea kila mtu thau thau so huyu akikosa nyote mtanipea thau twende hata unaweza unaweza nini unaweza fanya ile intro ya yenye ah wewe ndio wangu guy kwa nini mko mpanga intro si 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 mimi nime nime See, he thought he told me that the lady he wants has nini act like it let's go let's go let's go let's go 20 20 ni pe first more than it at final to join any our guest of the day i do the mathematical calculation oh, right. ah, hello apana apana you see unique ni nini you see unique imefanywa na watu wawili you do the mathematical calculation there are two artists who have done that line na one of them might be here so if it is the second if it is the latter <laughs> It is either na wewe mimi eh ana smang ana sijui itakuwa hivi mira mira na mhani wali wali wa ghetto ni ghetto wewe mira nam hase ni kofiti bro kabisa man thanks for having me 
Shukran manze. Bless. Bana it's been a minute. Mara mwisho tumekuwa na wewe tulikuwa kwa toi. Ah jokes. Na ilikuwa na nyuki. Eh. Na unaona kwa tu white. Una kwa tu mweupe kwenye maziwa. Kamera yake please. Ah acha bana. Nishane hizi. Zikona mumbi. Filter filter filter. I hear you wear the new shoes every week. Na they lied bro. Oh yeah. Like every week. Vya tuzinya rival last week. Atazima tena after 7 weeks. No it's like oh we can 7 days. So 7 weeks of 7 shoes 7 days. You can in short. Imwezi wiki moja ukivaizi. The next time you add in next month. Seven after 7 weeks. Ni story ya kolo bana. Bro, I don't know bro. Akiwa lie. Guy, I don't remember. Inaitwa oh, because you might like Doku. Inaitwa Doki. Eh, Doki. Introduce Doku. Gina, mimi nataka kujua Gina Doku. My full my official name. Official names are um, Christopher Tandi Kidara. Mimi Kikuyu. Eh, uh, Halfcast. Halfcast. Cocktail Kikuyu. Ah, Kikuyu. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> na I'm Ethiopian. Eh. Ah. That is your type, bro. Naombianga. Na kuzio type. Wewe ni mwana. Sadi mwana ni Ethiopia. Wala. Wala. Aha. Yeye ni mwana. huku sana. So eh brought up fully Kenya. Yeah yeah. Ah. Mm. Nani nani mwingi ofya? Pengine sisi sisi zako ni za kwanza ni mwanewe mbele za. Ni pande ya pande ya mother. Wala. Pande ya mother yeye. Noma sana. So how did how did the name Dovuku come to be? Uh this goes like zamani bro like kama 13 years ago wallahi mm nikifanya muziki unajua mimi jina imenisumbua for how long juu mm. nilikuwa nashanga bind of ku do you mean the ndovu that used to be kwa currency yetu si mm. ilikuwa na elephant flan uh-huh. ama ni ndovu ku what bro what are you talking about man <laughs> Kuzili ni chakula chakula. Kama unaonaje? Una haribu kitu. Ndio mimi sasa. Kama utuambie. Eh like genuinely. Ah mimi nilikuwa napenda. Na kucheki sana. Eh eh hiyo tulikuwa ga like I I I used to have a huge I still do. A huge love for elephants yani. Since I was a kid yani. Napenda dominance yake kwa jungle. You know the your dominance your intelligence yake na being that ni kuu yani ni animal ni mnyama yani akiwa mahali lazima umuone hmm. yeah so <clears throat> i used to call myself crispa hata uji tukifanya ngoma linita big up to crispa hmm. because really my name's my mother tongue in dandi means sparks so christopher then people say chris sparks chris sparks chris sparks ah, kwa crispa yeah kwa kwanza kuita crispa okay. but since niki yo, way back then when i was producing nilikuwa natumia producer tag yangu like 13 years ago was an elephant trumpet yeah umesema producer tag yako 13 years ago yeah. ulikuwa na producer 13 years yeah, ago yeah yeah man kwani ulianza ku produce ukiwa how old tangu nzaliwe lakini yo nilianza way back wala eh nilianza way back nilianza way 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 back uh-huh. like nikimaliza high school high school nikaka miaka kama mbili tatu yeah nikaanza production but sasa ni leave like it became serious like one year deep into production ndo nikaanza ku make like commercial songs you need around what what year mm same 2014 2014 you were already mm. off high school yeah ulianza yeah. shule high school wapi ka huo uhuru boys nilikuwa nachukia hiyo shule wale tulikuwa tuna fight nao vijana au alisoma chuo gani mimi somo ya kiambu high school aye alafu principal wao ndio alileta ngo shule yetu sasa tunaambwa tunde benchmarking huko bas alisoma kama huo learn from the best eh alikuwa mnyana ya sister school sana lakini ni sawa maze have so umemaliza kahuhuru from 4 yeah. then ukaingia okay, yeah. nikaitwa KU fanya geo special Kenyatta University eh yeah. uh-huh. nikakata <laughs> yeah ulikata by like i didn't have an interest in the unit so, so ulipata eh b plus 
ukaita kufanya juice special. Mm. Klaus unaelewa what juice special in. Okay, mm. Klaus anaelewa. Nimefanya special plan. Yeah, yeah nimekumbuka. <laughs> Tulia. <laughs> nice. I think so ni So miss kufanya actually. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, so nika nilikuwa na strength za mad sana na fik na English ndio zilikuwa strength zangu. Yeah. So nikaenda mzaya kanipeleka chuo inaitwa East African School of Aviation. Mm. Ukafanya aeronautical yeah. engineering sasa. For ilikuwa if i could three year course but li fanya f- four years juni lipata soup manze <laughs> maisha ilikuwa hivi eh makofi ya tonio serious ni pige ki soup manze in my third year was like bikini ka ka west one more year in school but Yeah. Mhm. Mm. Iko tu sawa. Kama kama kuna mtu ajaye extend maisha yake ya shule, ona nkaza, ona Antonio, birds of a feather. Mm. Flying so, together. So within within your process actually hapo ndo nilikuwa na I think nikiingia nikiingia chuo 2014. Yeah. Mhm. Ndo ndo sana nikaanza kwa serious na production. Kwa producer yake na iko Dida, Frasha, niko nazo dogo ziko YouTube. Eh. Hey. Hey. Na washo wengi. Kwa ni time ya Gengeton pia the songs was doing. Yeah. Ulifanya Gengeton. I was producing for the biggest gangeton hit. Ilko packaging. Believe it or not. Sasa so, so before them. Uh. Sikili fanya before them. Sasa so, so ndo waka kama baadaye waka tuchukua hiyo jina ikaenda. Oh. Yeah. Walai. The original leak. I think ndo kutumia links after this. Mlifanya yenyewe kitu pia packaging. Ilko packaging. Ilko. Your time the, 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 that was the way yani. So we mm. produce here. Akiwala. Mm. Discipline na ni time yote haimbi. but I wasn't confident enough with my craft. Siko confident sana na craft yangu. Mm-hmm. Uh, so nilikuwa na produce kama naimba kama producer chini ya maji na jisizia madoba zangu. Eh uh-huh. uh, na chize ule mtu nasikia hizi ni hizi ni eh Yeah, you were you won again confidence. Pia unaangalia wasanii una record vitu wanafanya pia unasema ai, kwani iko ni you know. Maze. Mm. Jo time gangeton literally you record anything and it goes. So it took mwaka gani sasa hii? Hapo ni 2015 na hapo. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 2016. Mm-hmm. Eh, nimefanya ngoma ya kwanza na Ude mnaitwa Shakila ni mimi nilifanya. The first song that made Shakila to be il connaît ton dove actually. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I'm not gonna say I'm proud of you. Eh <laughs> 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 so do me produce, uka produce, uka produce. Mm. Nini ili kufanya eventually you decide unataka we mwenyewe kuimba. What what made you decide you want to get into Honestly the... when I was in high school, yeah. tulikuwa na tulikuwa na boys wangu wanaitwa Suave. We used to we was like a rap duo. Uh, tuna make muziki entertainment tukienda pale ku present uh, shule sundays mna change ngoma za vibes cartel zikuwe gospel eh yeah, mna perform so so ulikuwa jose eh, sino sani sino sani and stuff but uh, after high school nilienda nil studio kwa jamani inaitwa full house sisi yango nilipeleka studio inaitwa full house ilikuwa halingam jamani inaitwa mgangezi kama kawa that time gospel ilikuwa imeshika sana mm. producers wa gospel ndio walikuwa anomo akani make a beat kwa ngoma fulani yenye i could catch vibe yangu he's a dope producer but he didn't quite get the vibe yenye nilikuwa nataka nikajiuliza hizi vitu kwa nini zifanyikaje and can you youtube academy wala nikaanza kwa hook sasa hapo mm. sasa nikaanza kujifunza production ikanichukua kama four years bila kutaka kufanya <laughs> ku write eh cuz oh. ina take nani yako interest nini mm-hmm. mm. Then later on villain like come nika nika figure out some things nika make do bangu. Hmm. Mm. So which was the first song you released? Ah ilikuwa ni to form ni gani? Oh you have a eh eh ilikuwa twenty. That was ilikuwa tena ilikuwa like 2014. Eh eh. Mm. Then we come we produce. Then nika kaka nika kaka. And 2018 is when I made ndovuku. Yeah but I am mm. 
to understand that you wrote and recorded Ndovuku alone. Yeah. Then look at two years. Yeah. Two whole years me kana iso ngenye Kenya. Ndo na kama mabishi mabishi pia na kwa gawa tu kukuingiza sana. Ni kwa tazama mabishi wao na mbe iki sana nini. Wallahi. Wewe si ni producer unafanya? Mhm. So ana nika lose cycle na hizo. Atumesema mabishi. Mhm. Wanakuanga? Wanaingiza gamu tu sengine. Ama 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 reasons gender ama juu ni juu. Do you know it's it's huh? it's very funny that uh, your greatest support comes from strangers. It's not that people are around you. So for for, for kama kama 3 years nime 2 years nimekalia hit song. Mazee wako chizia kama mmoja wako wako like ah wewe uko wewe ni producer wewe maybe you know. Wako mbio baki ki produce. Eh eh mzee but mm mm-hmm. thank god damn. Yeah. Then so you may you may you may only tengeneza 2018 your song. Mm. Then look at drop 2020. Mm. Nini ni happen do decide to drop. Sisi yangu yeah. anaitwa Jerry Photography anafanya ga photography so she she had she still has a studio mko hapo kilimani so kanambia ni azizi ngo mwana shina ukifanya siku hiyo tujaribu shoot reel moja kwa studio yangu mimi nikaenda nika ah tuka shoot na nikada tukafanya medley fulani ka gain traction kiasi then yo 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 oko ka snippet kenye ni ni record kando vuku nika tuka shoot na sisi yangu nika acha edit ka like Three weeks hivi so nilikuwa nasumbua gato direct msana mfanye editing inaitwa Jose mm. Jose ile video iko sawa so hata nime lose sake nayo mm. so nakumkaga nili niliambua eh hey, video yako iko ready by the nikasema ah, nikaekelea tu kwa Instagram mm. you know at that time nilikuwa na 700 and something followers okay. on Instagram 700 yeah 700 followers yeah. Mm-hmm. so nika post Ah, mimi nikaenda shughuli tu zangu. Yeah. Nilikuwa na Ivasha Road I remember. <laughs> Nilifungua simu yangu niko na image notifications. It's like ni post na Nairobi gossip. Mm. And the rest is history bro. Wow. Cuz your sound ilikuwa sasa ina trend TikTok and stuff. Yeah. Again the, the biggest sound, it became the biggest sound. At that time at it was crazy cuz ilikuwa it got really fucked 50 mic. Mm. Seems on TikTok eh. Yeah. Mm. Alafu ilikuwa na 50 million streams. I remember mm-hmm. in a span of like two weeks eh you tell you tell me to look cuz line yangu ili ili create okay that's a different story ili <laughs> ili kuna controversy flani uh-huh. eh so what was line yangu ili trend mtoto wangu akitokea hiyo nitakata eh eh hiyo time hiyo time ndo makampuzi ilikuwa zinafanya selection nini so eh kani ni kwa story ngine Alikuwa amekata jio. Honest alikataa kuenda KU by the way. I mean it's cool but ni interest yangu. Mm. Mm. So sasa so hiyo ikitaka controversy but nothing less bad song ilikuwa kubwa. Yeah, ili ili do poor then god of uh-huh. my fans yani. So did they take any legal like, ah relax. I was in KU at the time. Wallahi. Eh hey, 2020 <laughs> <laughs> sio? Ah ah sio mwan ndugu zangu wa high school. Eh mimi nimesoma KU. Na tunzo sisi kwa high school. I mean like why you went high school Alikuwa yule Alikuwa Ranger Kid bro Just 20 you know Tulia Ndio alikuwa okay when you know Who son is he So 2020 akiingia KU akiingia KU mimi nilikuwa KU nakumbuka student council wali wali mimi wali walipeleka walikuwa niliona kwa kuna kuangana kama ka Nairobi Gossip KU mm. ka KU Gossip Club okay aka <laughs> post tu kwa ati wanaenda kusu mm. for defamation yeah. it happened it actually happened mimi nili argue you o, know uli, uli suiwa oh alikuwa mimi nilitambia wao vijana wako actually they pull down the song of youtube wali weka strike time walitoa mm ikiwa like 3 million on youtube wow eh Eh hey, kapigwa strike nini tukasumbuana sumbuana but ilikuwa some particular guys that was not the stand of the school eh hey. and don't come to realize you should lay the distance na hizo claims juke ina maanisha kila kitu kula ugali kweli kula ulali vitu mom kimbia huko so tsema tsema ti ati mtoto wangu kitu wake hiyo ina maanisha particularly that school oh Mm. Oh. Eh, so alikuwa mkojana njia 
hiyo story ya mumbo ya katu hiyo story yeah. but it was a blessing in these guys still mm. uh, Julie bring so much attention to like wewe you know, na sasa ndio yeah. ume, umeingia kwa game yeah, yeah, yeah. honestly yeah. kama CEO hata mimi singe kujua i feel pado mimi tazima tu kweli ndio kitu nilifahamini kajua ndio after that then ni kwa to history like za kwanza uh, kwa kitu wake you you the song ika hit ika hit ika hit wewe mm. unapenda wake you mbaya si mka wake you si mimi wake you wale kitu wake you wewe si uko wake you bro si uko wake you na tumeka hapa si ati watu wanaopenda ndo vuku wake you mimi na test yeah so ndo vuku imetoka it how how big were the doors that it opened it was a tricky moment because covid was happening so i had a big song on platforms like in with, no show. with no money yes. <laughs> literally uh, so niko my interviews na fanya ma tv niko kila mali but you know hakuna mali kuna meruse perform mm. so uko like ni kama unaongoja una unajiuliza maybe covid ikikam ikiisha watu watakuwa wameshachoka na hii you know yeah. you'll go just crossing fingers like that mm-hmm. Yeah so but eventually things opened up for for real then calligraph mm. and butros happened Buti. to get into the song mm, each 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 other yeah uh-huh. so i know of buti ili ni 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 na jo calligraph ndo best yake flani ali kutex butros buti sasa i period nimekupeleka mbali ju after nimalize shule niliingia job wilson tulenda ug for like a year tukaingia wilson mm-hmm. so nilikuwa nafanya <coughs> aircraft maintenance huko wilson bro listen it was lady lorry helicopter wewe unataka influencer bado au unataka mtu anafanya na aircraft nakwambia hapana ethiopia uh-huh. imagine sasa imagine aku link anajuana na airport si manzi sikuwa na natengeneza kaeni wallahi eh like ilikuwa more like It's, it's like more like ile um, induction training unajua wale wase mshapita page uh, face ya internship mwanza ku kuinductive into company so mnalipo tu peanuts mdagi mdagi mm, relax hadi wa basi eh, unaona vile pune na fungilia ngo carrot hapa ina shida make visa eh so ilikuwa tu hiyo form yani but i love it mm. ilikuwa poa mnachukua ma flights ma test flights kwanza asubuhi mnaruka na chopa kila siku asubuhi mm. so unapostia unapostia siku hiyo ni whatsapp ilikuwa inashika sasa mimi nikienda mwa family gatherings walikuwa najiamini kwa madomba haya so you see na ile like daily eh cuz it's a part of the routine you know unajua eh lazima before pilot rachukue ndege lazima mpige ma test flights ah so asubuhi ndo umeingia umetoka kwa mtu na ingia kwa chopa stop the cap <laughs> yeah but you for sadiote pia i guess ni ni juni kitu interesting pia aviation is interesting really interesting and i loved it pia mm. but kafika point still history ya covid tuka kwa laid off cuz flights were cancelled all over the country yeah. so mm manze kama kama ni savings kiasi umeka eka mimi nikaingia busy ya kuza masks I'm just telling you all the story ndo tufikie mali. Twende, twende. Kidogo sana niambie. Nitakukontrol. Twende nani? Ah, so nikaanza kuza mask. So my mom, my mom my mom does tailoring but on a large scale level. Eh, uh, so nikamwambia niko na design. Mmeskeve na mapang kuongea. Anataka kuwa humble. Wako na kampuni ile ya kushona ah, zile zile zote za Kenya lakini ni la. Ni wako na label mzima. Mazi lakini ni mama. It's a manufacturing company ni besa ni large scale. Asa hiyo ni story yako utatuambia. Mimi nime mashini tano hizi za kushona. TikTok nacha. Mazi. Actually actually my mom ni mtu anajua kushona like unaweza mpatia nguo kushona. Eh. Yeah, see you see us through na sema. But place ana work she's employed actually. Eh. But place ana work ni wanafanya large scale. Yeah. Eh so nikamwambia niko na design ya masks fulani. Mhm. Nilikuwa nachukua hizi makaratasi za kubebea. Super. Eh hizi zili after polythene zibaniwe. Nikabaya hizo material na ika sponge ndani. I create design ya mask. So my selling point was nachukua na shakibiriti. Naenda kwa super na shakibiriti 
namwambia Vamas kwa kawaida puliza hii kibiriti inazima <laughs> na ikakoa yangu na puliza kwambia hivyo ndio covid hizi kupata ikona three protection layer eh yeah. yeah, but just something na wasalikuwa na bye ili make unit nilisalulit unit mob kwa super eh yeah. yeah so nikadhani hata mimi nikadhani success yangu iko kwa biz uanze kutengeneza mama yeah, but so na covid ilikuwa busy ya wave mm. ilikuwa na ilifika point hata mask zikaanza kuzwa 10 bob na zilikuwa zinatoka one chwani bro mm. so yeah ivo ivo hizo mm-hmm. tu nani kidogo nikapata na advert ya online jamaa anasema anataka voice over artists na mimi niko like niko na studio hapa anafanya kila kitu sasa hii just kwa employed mm. niko like na kama makeshift studio home so nikaanza ku ku record my voice overs nika record uh, audition hiyo stuff nikatuma tu kwa hiyo email these lads mse wao na ig ah so by god's grace jamaa anaitwa abh brian loch is a producer sijui kwa namjua namjua akaniambia yo you guys ule jamaa alikuwa na tunatafuta nasikia huko go through kwanza eh hey, oh, hey. eh goli tu ajumu yalikuwa na eh hey, <laughs> huo alikuwa rana zap mimi ndio alikuwa rana zap sasa nikaambia huyu jamaa akukaa anatuambia tu hadi ako mbali lazima tumlipie nani akama record mm. tumsikia you are the closest to what we need so kuja hapo ngong road eh hey, nika kike nika jo busy mejipa nikakimbia ebh ni record Voice over kitu kitu rahisi tu nimemaliza niko na nimekewa 20k. <laughs> Nikasema ah kumbe nilikuwa jisumbua na industry. Yes <laughs> yako. <laughs> <laughs> eh bana huku 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 kwa ads pesa iko eh. Unaongea okay, kidogo hivi yeah. 20. Mm yeah, unaongea kidogo tu hivi na sasa ni sensitization za vitu za za covid ilikuwa mm. project ya USA I think kwambia watu wavae mask na vile kuosha mkono. Yeah zilikuwa zina run adverts kwa radio. So eh hey, all that stuff tuko create rapo na ABH sasa ame save number yangu na niona kwa ananitiaga jobs eh. in the uku hivi bado na na record <coughs> ma ma muziki wa say ma project zangu zingine na post whatsapp I was re- siko nafanya anything major with it yeah. so nika record ndo vuku nika post tu watu status ni kwa kila mtu nilikuwa na blast kila mtu na links <laughs> Hey guys. Share mm. Share like yeah, comment this... and do not forget to subscribe. subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> this is a new song man. Really scoop kwa napata engagement crazy cuz watu wa unajua ma fans watu wamekuzoea wamekuzoea. ABH actually told me this bro. Uh, have you ushaifikiria ku post muziki yako in a different platform ama ni kushinda tu ki blast ya wasa kwa WhatsApp cuz hii ni crowd isha kuzoea. I think he from a pro- production perspective aliniambia hiki tu alijoy hiki tu nikali. Ebi acha kaniambia mafans wako wamekuzoea. Anza ku post kitu kwa new new fans. I mean new fan base inamaanisha nini? Ni ende wapi ama ni nikamchukua lightly. So next time tuna record voice overs. Akaniambia actually atuko na record voice overs aliniita. Akaniambia nataka home it mse fulani. Niko like okay, nika come. Mm, ana umse umse mnaweza work na hey, TikTok nini kuka hivi manzi ni buti ni kole kwa mimi niko askiza buti sana je napenda shrap mm. is like eh eni aje poa sana so mm. buti alikuwa na ngome ni to ati wanjiri ko single ni ko single pia niko na sumbo TikTok mbaya so yeah tunamaliza na but um tuko na na ABH I could like eh hey, mimi nataka work na umse mm-hmm. so anaambia buti Eh hey, bicha nambia BTA hey, ni aje ha namba zake ziko aje so saba yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, so yeah. sana na YouTube eh hey. hey, YouTube bro I think I don't think I'll like 2k subscribers <laughs> akobe sura hiyo ni mechoka ya BTA hadi wale wote wao mtamechoka kwa hivyo get out of here get out of here man Sh- I'm saying akashanga sasa hivi ni bro mshikanisha ana kuja kunishikanisha ni inwe ni inwe mse upcoming you know but sasa by by god's grace alikuwa amesikia hiyo doba tiktok wewe eh. unule msa wake you eh yeah, wakati yeah. wa wendo mse wake mm. cuz hiyo stuff ilikuwa imeanza kufanya rounds on tiktok eh msa wake you ah so tukafunga doba na buti actually we were to release the song with butros mka record eh tukasha record huko nini mm-hmm. so now kali alikama up to close in shoot video. 
because na kumbuka hata hiyo time nilikuwa nimeenda Isli ku buy makladi za vida eh luku za vida nimeenda Isli tulikuwa na sis jamaa kan text ai jeka mzaniaje bro mind you by then wasani wengi sana walini reach out manze eh na wengine hata tulienda up work na wao you know Yeah, later shout out to x x ray in put on kwa doba kali sana yeah so yeah tuka <laughs> kibailuku msana niambia ni aje umefikiria kufanya collab naomba nisha do hiyo ngoma manze una dayaje akatumia picha yake na uji ukiwa misimama na yeye so, ilikuwa naona maskama obviously juu okay. mm unataka kunifanyia unataka kuniambia sasa juu kuna uji ni fanye <laughs> eh <laughs> akanemba there's a reason nimekufuna ni hiyo kandumia namba tukabanja akanambia amepata uji akisikiza hiyo ngoma yangu ya TikTok mm. so like hey for real eh so of course uji kuni reach watu wanaanza kubonga eh hey, uja maana take advantage au sasa ni kanambia wewe chukua advantage ndakupea namba uji wa umhal mwambie ni aje mimi nikasema nitapoteza tushafanya adobe na buti you go lose nothing i just made the call bwana nikamsho Yo. Mimi naitwa Ando. <laughs> Bro, the next day ilikuwa na bus. The next day. Yeah, we did the call. Hivyo tu after that call like the next day into me a bus. Ka mechangamka. Mm, yaani kumwambia hiyo Sunday tunafanya video tafadhali usikose kuja. <laughs> <laughs> eh hey, manze. But the video haikufanywa Nairobi. Haikuwa mbali sana. Okay, kind of far but ni limuru because of sovereign suits. Mm. Mm. Aka come through. Eh hey, manze. Na hivyo ndio hit song ikatokea. Eh yeah, all but still TikTok was heavy your time. Mm-hmm. So yo even him jumping on the song he was he was kind of sure that it it would end up a big yeah. yeah. Which you thank God for manzi. Yeah. Mm. Obviously um by virtue of when you longa kusu TikTok mm. TikTok you're talking about TikTok as it is mm. it has played a very big role in what huge you have become. Huge. So do you think it's right to say that TikTok is among or at least the biggest platform where artists need to like need to push especially in matters go market songs yeah mhm mm, there's an issue with like things like the revenue yeah. stream but what you get out of it is is i'd say it's a it's a fair fair exchange mm. for for an artist for a record label it may be different <laughs> uh, but for an artist for an artist you tiktok on a database kubwa sana very huge na age, age range yake ni kubwa like kuna wase from from like 40s kwa na mpaka 18 year olds you know mm. so when you when you when your platform is when your song is doing good on those platforms yani yani mm. the cons of it pia ime water down in some way content mm-hmm. because now wasani wanacha ku create mziki wanapenda ni mm-hmm. mziki yenye ina trend tiktok mm-hmm. unajaribu tu ku duplicate hiyo vibe mm-hmm. yeah ama track sema e line e line ita trend tiktok mm-hmm. you know mm-hmm. so ina kwa tiktok ndio ina design mziki which is risky i believe jo vitu zitaenda tu zifanane na uh, kutakuwa na different uh, kitu unique mm-hmm. But marketing wise it 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 really I don't know what those guys did mm. but wali catch database zingine huge sana and wameza ku keep people glued onto the screens you mm. know I guess it's because of kufanya content kwa fupi yeah, so hiyo dopamine effect unashinda tu kipata vis-a-vis YouTube vis-a-vis IG so mm. yeah mm. now what's your take on them at the time kuna time flani last year walipata ku ban TikTok who kuban tiktok gava ah, oh. kwa kumekujua propaganda at yo tiktok iko na nini nini ina faida ni wewe nini mm, I, i feel uh, regulating would make sense mm. rather than banning because you know it's not tiktok that brought these things tiktok ni kio it's, it's a reflection of what the society mm. is you know no. nilikuwa nasikia kuna vitu weird wasa walikuwa nafanya usiku nini but that's a reflection of society really see tiktok tiktok imefanya tu imeleta tu platform ya wase kuje express you know so unless sasa eh mimi na feel me I stand with regulation rather than banning because uh-huh. it's changing lots of lives i mean i wouldn't have go- eh bro zamani as an artist you had to be signed by this huge record label 
who has placed crazy money on you for marketing. Right now, anyone, anywhere, from Venezuela, ma, wapi, bro, aneza, aneza tuangoma sahi, and na raise a julika na wase, and change the family of people around them, you know? Yeah. So, the positives are more, definitely more. Ule na ule demo, make me sweat, how many wet. Uyo, si ya vishita grami. Make your tailor. And actually, 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 take a... <laughs> Even in, in the Kenyan scene, yeah. in the Kenyan scene, bro, kiangalia like three years ago, no socialite r- that came out three years ago that is not a product of TikTok. Just think about it. Bio, when you saw news, when you saw nani, when you dance, when you saw nani, akuna... Very few, very few, and and and, ca- and the rare options is that you still trended on TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever you did, you trended on TikTok. Other. Yeah. Mm. Hi, Abasi. You know, genre of music? What genre of music do you do? Good music. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so your your kind of music is good music. Yeah. So there's this conversation about Abantone and Gengeton. Mm. We saw Gengeton come rise and then fall. Quote and quote. Mm-hmm. But I was here with Major and we were having the conversation, and he told me that Gengeton is still very present. Mm-hmm. Just that um, there are some policies, some of it to flan is quite in place, then you believe in pioneers were Gengeton at the time. Mm-hmm. Then um, producer, we are producer, Monyali, I'm a quacky push, Abantona, and it was. Motif, I'm a. Motif, Motif, I come with a new genre that. Mm-hmm. Like I, like I produce some songs now mm. I, I produce as you know I can produce and now people have received uh, a banjo mm-hmm. as a genre in Kenya so what do you think in Afanyanga in Afanya, what do you think makes musicians come like the way they did mm. during Gengetoni sailors um, bulldogs ethic but they had to ask anymore there is a new genre and mm. what what's there to say that this genre will stay as a producer mm. I feel that sound is easily sellable mm-hmm. because it's not foreign to the ear okay. yeah, as a producer yeah ni raisi kuselio sound kwa sababu si foreign kwa masikio na kuna kuna science deep hata za hit songs wase usample la decode progressions <coughs> na shindo ingoma inakubambia nini kumbe ni ngoma imekuwa ikirudiwa over and over again mm. inachenjwa tu top notes or something ama instruments okay hiyo it's such it, it works there's no as long as you do it legally mm. It works. There's no scene to that. Mm-hmm. Kama the fugees. Uh, yeah. Um, I'm losing the melody. Ready or not? Here I come. Mm. Like team in, is, uh, in, in, in my bed. Like uh, yeah, <clears throat> people yeah. have been doing that and it's been working. So <laughs> as, a, as a producer, uh-huh. you know, makes sense. As an artist, as an artist, uh, ukiandika uki kitu kaa kachi kwa hiyo vibe yenye ni already ni familia na wase mm. ni rahisi ku fly but sasa kuku sustain hapo there's there's, uh, there's the artist ele- artistic element of you you know itakuja tu kugunduliwa mm-hmm. you know i'm not saying that 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 wase wase wameenda na hiyo wave at juu kuna wasi wa noma sana kwanza na heshima sana kwa hiyo wewe abanto you know but kuna wengine pia wanajificha huko ndani wana carry wana bibo tu na wewe yeah. unaona uh-huh. but now when it comes when it comes to watu wanze kusikiza huyu msebedha na imba ganini wanaanza sasa ku kufanya mskata na what what generally happens mnaanza kujiform into groups when gengeton came in it was a whole people affair This is just my opinion and you said ni Bible yeah. truth ni venye perspective yangu kulikuwa na whole affair sisi ni wase tumekaa eh kuna ni wana wametoa hata sisi tutoe tuna supportiana ni vijana new wave tunaoondoa vijana wazee you know but now watu wakianza kwa scrutinize mnaanza kujiform into groups so kuna kwa na 
mnakosa unity kati yenu hiyo ndio kitu hiyo angusha hizo waves mm. yeah every time you, you start ukianza kuona abanton wameanza kujiform na ya mbogiase na mbogiase within abanton mm. just know that's the trend inaenda kudunda mm. yeah so do you think it will last it simply depends with the artists oh when you are more yeah. because if you if you see on the flip side mm. the music that has dominated say the the, the world right now is afrobeat there's no disparity at any genge akina ruga any genge akina omale any genge bro those guys are synergetic we're doing their stuff together yeah. that's why it's easier to sell one sound uh. even export it outside so unakuja huko Kenya yes we are very gifted very gifted not to talented beyond but utapata Beyonce Kenya utapata Drake Kenya it's true yeah mm tunakuaga so atuna sound moja yenye tumeamua uh-huh. this is our sound let's push it uh-huh. regardless of my difference bro in <coughs> sound yetu so we would have a bigger sound that we would export uh-huh. outside there but vitu zinaenda ku change so kenyan music needs to find identity that's what you're saying iko 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 ni venye watu hawaja line iko iko yani ukitakuja identity ya kenya uh-huh. fanya tu research angalie ni dob, ni doba type gani zimekuwa ziki trend Kenya ama for like, Kenya for for like 10 years. Okay. Ziko na certain pattern. Mm. Eh. Yeah. Sasa tuambie hiyo pattern. Genge. <laughs> ah. Mm. Genge. Mm. Very very few hit songs come out of that part. Na ilikuwa kapuka is the kick and snare. Yeah. Kap, 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 kap. So hiyo ndo pattern ya muziki ya Kenya. Yeah. Whether uko msanii unaipenda au uipendi, that's Kenyan culture. Yeah. So if we would be humble enough to know this is our sound and we start pushing it to QC water, be it from the bigs like kina BN Nyash to anyone to close you know? like yeah, he's going to drop <laughs> his new music. Nice. <laughs> you know? You see if all of us if all of us have that <laughs> mm. like you see you you not find you really find drill music in Nigeria. Do you know of a drill song from Nigeria? Mm-hmm. But they're exporting it to the Grammys because ah, they've streamlined they. the sound. You get? Mm. Do you know? Uh, do you know of many R&B artists from, let's say Tanzania? Mm-hmm. Do you know a drill song from Tanzania? Mm-hmm. They've streamlined their Zouk music, and that's what they sell. Mm. So pia sisi tuki tuki acha tu kiburi usanii si ati mimi mimi na za rap na za imba la tuko tu na hii ni sound yetu tunaipush mm. sound ya East Side itajulikana and hiyo bagenya kina bana bwana wanakula pia yeah, eh, ni possible lakini msia kuna content tunasikia terms like terminology zook cap zook ni nani ya sound wewe ah bro like ethiopian tia yeye usi acha kusini bro bado mesimu kwa introduction tukianza tiktok Okay mimi kwa nimeanza. Mm. Tuko tunaona anga udem flani sometime ya covid. Mm. Tunaona udem tunashanga eh. Tena venye na kapoa. Mimi nitafunguka roho. Jam. Uzuri sasa yata yuko Afrika. Anyway. Kidogo kidogo tumemwona na ndovu. Anaitwa Claudia Nisabwa. Kla? Claudia. Kla? so mimi kwa nataka mimi alafu time flani ni Nairobi gossip ishai boss mm-hmm. yeah, i think ni Nairobi gossip uh, my heart say my heart sank Klaus didn't even have a heart at the time it is like just when ali did ulikuja kumuokota badala huko yani ulipata product ishai nini so nini gani so nini you guys na Claudia mimi honestly sijaielewa like okay sijaielewa mm-hmm. 
hadi wa leo najua mnakuanga mabest because I've, I've, I've seen you guys work together for mm. so long but mshaikuwa 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 a fabric fabric the fabric ni jeli yangu mshaikuwa a thing na claudia ah claudia ni best yangu sana wala unajua si tulikuwa has broken so for nothing bro mm, false accusations bro wow. Wow. Hey, Claudia yeah. ni bishta yangu sana like ni tu Selene ni nasema. Hey, in true in in uh, daylight bro. Nah. Anyway, <laughs> but naelewa naelewa mean ni penga kuna mtu anaweza Hello. Akiwa na Mule wa class anaitwa ngwaje. Anaitwa ngwaje ude. Mgeni? Umaish na gameta ya sasa tu basi. Marcel Martin, wewe ndo unatry ku protect nini? Anyway, that he let's do song. Mimi nataka kuuliza swali kuhusu Ude Malimba cash crop za nyandaroni mawaru. Yes. Eh. Oni bebe tele kile. Eh. Sitabui wewe maunenge. Mami wa maembe. Na maenge. Gastek nimde mama fom. Hadi dogo. Ndogo. Niulizeje? Mhm in your own opinion mimi sasa nakuuliza vitu zote za animation nataka kuuliza mtu ako na con- competence ya ka producer na msanii okay ngesha lika akakuwa big deal at, at, at a certain point mm. and hakuwa anymore shida mm. ya industry in that context ni gani ni yeye msanii ama ni ni investors ama ni nini like what is the problem with the industry where you find an an artist with trend or at least I'll call her Natis because she, she sang na yo mm. yake ya spider. Well, spider clan. Spider clan. Mm. Spider clan. Mm. Spider clan. Yeah. Spider clan. Cuz what will him hype come hype come hype so is it mm. the Kenyan people is it mm. the Kenyan music industry is it the Kenyan music industry investors or is it what happens to to the Ngesh that we now know and other people who represent Ngesh. Me honestly jokes they put on Ngesh. Mm-hmm. So ningekuwa mm. namjua on a personal level ningekuwa najua ni nini ilifanya mbona like as you said ayuko anymore mm. but uh, maybe naweza kupata two general thoughts about yeah, yeah, general opinion thoughts. yangu probably vitu zingine vile zio happen mm-hmm. so ingine ni unaweza uziwa hype na ukubali na ubai hey. unaweza mm. uziwa hype na ubai eh hey, unaweza uziwa <laughs> hype na ubai mm-hmm. um, um, if 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 you need understand na ni ngumu ni ngumu maybe for us ku understand ume in your opinion yangu si ati again na ya kurudia ni opinion yangu mtu si ni crucify or something ni vile tu mimi na naifikiria unaweza kuwa Kenya imefanya u trend ni ni aspect fulani yako maybe a comic aspect of you na ukose kuamini au amini ni kitu kingine imefanya u trend Okay. You know? Yeah. It's like uh, leo ni trend leo mimi ni dancer. Useme mimi ni mdem. Nime trend ni dancer. Nipige dance move fulani. Funny. It trend but mimi najua watu wananipenda juu ya mwili wangu. Lakini kweli wana. Ile siku atasema otherwise. Mm. Unaona ita nitoa timing itani confuse. Ama nita focus energy zangu rather than doing more funny dances. Wamekuwa serious. Ni mm, mkuu serious na na, na, <laughs> na shape vitu zangu so yeah. it's a tough space you know. Yeah. Ni poa ku understand watu wameku embrace na what na uki by the hype unafaa kuangalia si hype tu unasoma. Feedback really ni kujua ni nini watu wanapendea hii kitu you know. Yeah. Is it the rawness the the is it really my 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 singing my my technique yeah you know my cadence my flow is it my image how i look is it so ukeza ku distinguish hizo ndo utaelewa ni nini utakipo kifeed because at the end of the day is a business eh watu wana demand hii una una keep ukiwapatia usiopoteze sana so i feel maybe your communication do in as i get pole is i get mali kwe ikwe eh iko clear ni za cloud cloud mm. eh ni za cloud msani <laughs> you make sense <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. okay. Mm. kwa nini nimekuwa nikijiuliza hiyo swali for so long mm. anyway mm. back to dovu mm. dovu nini bro eh hey, ume ume 
<laughs> Dovu does not have a trace or anything said about him with a woman. Ukona dem, unajua nimepiga research. I have done my research. Hakuna hakuna dem. Okay. Usiribu kitu mzuri. Usiribu kitu mzuri. Tutupe hizo za ndani sheke. Sensational. Because I want to know Dovu 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 Ana mimi nataka kujua. Because there's no way that there's no way documented who Dovu has been with or is with. Kidogo hata pengine wewe ni monk. Nikasema. Hey. Vaji. Ana this guy is no Hakuna story yote ile zile. Hakuna story yote zile toka akasema ni ex wake. Wewe ni Ethiopia. Now I'm really mad. Ukona kusua. Ukona kusua. Nobody says you will not wear anything. Mm. How have you managed to keep that brand that safe? I, I don't think he's trying to keep the brand safe. Ni was chana wanitaki. For anyone for anyone who has been watching this. Hata huko nyuma tuko na volunteers. Unajua unajua sijui sijui mbona watu wanakuwa game sale perception yangu. Yaani inakuwa ga player sana. So inakuwa gata niki 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 like say I'm interested in a lady. Niko interested na dem fulani. Najaribu kuongea na yeye ananiekea gatuma. Ma block. Ma block so so You know ina ina kwa frustrating. Eh <laughs> <laughs> hey, so na lazima tutafute pesa. So mwingine tunachora hiyo story tu. So literally you're saying on camera my chorea story za madem ju hawakutaki. Eh hey, mimi napenda madem bila shame. Like, wote wote uh, ala dem. Like you know Ethiopian. Yeah. Hey yo. Unajua ni jibu triki? Mimi ni Ethiopia. Tulia. Mimi ni Ethiopia. Sio ndio ni mix like we confused me. Yeah, cocktail ya Rwandis na Ethiopia. Bas. Kwa sasa you are not at the moment. Ama kuna na if if Mbe unaniona. If I'm blessed. Tulia <laughs> tatujibu. If I'm if I'm if I'm blessed. Yaani kuna definitely kuna definitely wase na cheki na aya na cheki cheki. Wase. Wase. Kwa ni Ah ah sio ndio yani. Unani hard sapa, unani hard. Unani hard. Una choma. Wewe acha. Mtu wake to jinta. Acha kai ba. Bro. I sit up and a disclaimer. Uh-huh. Yaani eh, siko nikibarikiwa niki yaani. Mm. <laughs> nikibarikiwa. Mm. Hai hapa. Ni gani? Hadi kibarikiwa. So, so to say me you're not married. Uh, no. <laughs> you're not married. <laughs> you're not engaged to marry. Ah. ah. So, pass, so, pass pass pass. Ah, pass, ah, pass, ah, pass. Ah, pass 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 and even though if even if if even if i was yani i'm with you jua so point so point ni like lakini iko hopefully he has been in the game for for how long kuna mtu anajua hizi vitu bro eh so 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 this is for that team nauna Lazima niko ni produce toy. Wewe kwa hiyo production yote si zipo za toy. Production you must have produced something bro. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So to say me it's you you like it the way it is. I mean bro good vibes. Ni ni alafu pia pia na grow as a human being you know. 
eh sisi taka ku kwa kwa in commitment na msee alafu sina sija, sija develop the level of maturity ku ku ku, ku stay na msee mmoja cuz inahitaji discipline plan you know yeah. so rather than kumi za wase kama wase kuna <laughs> tiktokers wengine hapa wanashindaga pamoja Miskia. tiktok kuna ad page in their tiktok msikia wanafunga ngatu hivi macho mmoja ni masai nishai wacheki nishai wacheki anyway back to what is trending in kenya so tuko na vitu mbili zina trend kenya um sasa kuuliza kuhusu femicide because you stated your your stand on that. Nataka kuongelea watu wanapiga kiroro. Watu waliamua watu wakaenda waka waka watu walienda sherehe. I think it was yesterday. Yeah, so sad. Alafu yeah. yeah. Like you see, these guys are not even on social media you guys. So let me educate you. Kuna watu walienda wakapiga illicit brew. Uh-huh. And sadly, I think six people Six. Died. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of a number have lost their sight completely. Or just like the illicit brewery. Yeah, that's the meaning of illicit. Counterfeit <laughs> product. Yeah. Yeah, but sell a counterfeit for thank you. Okay. Yeah. It's counterfeit, yeah. right? Yeah. It's a, it's a Oh, you are a shiki. A shiki na shoot shot to lay. Hey. That's why I don't know. Hey, what una what una let them have other things here. Aha. So in matters in matters in matters um government what do you think should be done about such a matter because it has it costs people lives. Sana sana na in e e in a route from kitu najua ni zandani zandani eh. Mhm. Kitu najua ni counterfeit product. Cuz hata like Like if you see like EABL on a struggle sana na counterfeit product. Unapata kuna watu uko mashinani wana 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 manufacture something that looks like it's the same but it's not and they're trying so hard to fight it but unapata zile vitu ni bei cheap sana. So wale wasio wanapenda maelika za 30 bob manini na ikiwa si nini kwa kikombe nini. Yeah. No, and it's a problem because as it's regulated the contents kuna kuna quantities za methanol zinaweza kupitia mali fulani iko si fit for consumption ya ndo maskia swing na poto za macho mm-hmm. inaweza kuharibu hata liver yako so yeah it's all it all roots from a point of greed yani mm-hmm. eh yeah, wase wana wanatengeneza hizo mama mate illicit wako hapo unaweza pata yeye hata katagi hiyo maji mm-hmm. Eh yeah, but ako hapo quote and quote still to make a decent lifestyle. Really? Apeleke watu wake kampuni kitu complicated sana. Juu ya na feel ya kiombe Mungu saidia biashara yangu kuepoa. Uh-huh. Nisaidie watu wa kunywa hii pombe sana. Uh-huh. But tunapata pia mm zinafanya watu wako crazy addicts wana mess up. Eh yeah, uki, uki uki kata maji nani you know we we if we look at alcohol ni vitu kaizi illicit brews ndio zifanya watu wakwe crazy addicts you know you know because alcohol you can consume it decently you know you know zachukua kataska yako na unaipiga decently and it utakuwa na lazima ungeze mataska akiwa like ungeze decently na kuna you know but the things that cost people nani utapata ni over over indulgence in such things you know so yeah i feel regulation ya yeah, maybe body ya kebs as i say mm. is a kwa so cuz it's costing people's lives you know yeah. uh, should do an adopia over indulgence of the right product as well can yeah, can lead to yeah so it's just quantities mm-hmm. it's a quantity issue if you think about it maybe quantity ya yeah. illicit brew ya methanol ni crazy na kulipua bro na hiyo 30 bob mpiga kwa kikombe so mm-hmm. so sad to those families and yeah. their, their members manze mm-hmm. yeah but ni sad ni kitu sad manze mm. mm. ume perform ya president ama ushai perform in any political um audience Yeah, once. Pekiaki. 
Wapi? Nyayo Stadium. Kenya. PPMC Then after that mnaendanga state house. Mm. So in the state house. Eh. Yeah, Ulikuja. Yeah. Yeah. Ilikuwa yeah. yeah. ilikuwa yeah. ilikuwa yeah. 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 time yangu ya kwanza mwanzo. Kwenye state house. Yeah. Ni white. Ilikuwa white. I mean ni kuna loans fit kuna kafiri mpeni na mnaishi state house hapa. Tulea bro. Eh mnashtua. Mnashtua ni wapi huku? Tunajelea sita uzi Aruto. Uko na yeye sio huko ni wapi? Ah. Lifestyle. No, no, we were looking for but we didn't get the one that we wanted so we yeah. opted for this. Mm-hmm. But don't worry in Ethiopia. <laughs> you will show him the site. Let me I want to know about about state house. So mm. like did you have a sit down na yeye na the president or kulikuwa na hizo but uh, you know na lazima tukienda unapigwa picha kwa ile nani umesimama muonesha wa Kenya ulikuwa <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, karibu hizo white pillars zinakuwa zinakuwa interesting sana inakufanya usikie poa mm. but yeah n- nothing too close so, like you haven't had a one on one president no and no. Uko in, the closest I've, I've been ya kiwa mahali ameka hapa juu ndo mimi na namwimbia hapa juu. Na uko Talanta Hela? Huh? Ulienda hiyo kitu ya Talanta Hela. There was, was sometimes content mm. creators and musicians only tamwa sit state house I think. Mm. Yeah, haukuwa huko. Ah, uh, miss kwa. Ah. Na so PPMC ile ilipo mado. Mimi sijui hata mimi ya hope. Nilikuwa na hope mm. ungekuwa niambie. <laughs> <laughs> sijui sijui wallahi. Ah. Yeah. Uh, engagement like PPMC ni uh, permanent presidential music commission. commission. Yeah, so wana wanapenda ku, ku select various mm-hmm. artists na content creators during celebrations za culture yetu sikasi wa Kenya. Yeah. So yeah, I don't think you in our and in our to Caribbean preserve that. But me na feel kona hit song. Yeah but I mean ikifika time yake itafika also so, assuming ana watch eh As, uh, which, 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 which is his camera <laughs> this one ambia prezo Mr President yes eh ukacheza na hiyo mafuta akiwa la eh eh bana Mm. So have mm. have you been invited to other um parties maybe ama political gatherings zenye zina warrant kama msanii ama you've been in that context za politicians maybe uh, quite quite rarely bro wallahi mm. mimi na politics ni kidogo eh uh, mm. um well, you're not you know that i hate politics but mm. atuko converse and sana uko converse mm. na politics mm. na sai sai ni ukiukizu ukizaambiwa um talk about the state of the nation economically i follow okay politics politics is policy making is law vitu za law si ndio yeah. but vinye kenya ukisema politics inamaanisha gossip you know mm-hmm. <laughs> eh hey, nani alifanya nani alislap nani leo nani hizo si for tagi sana mm-hmm. but vitu zinatuhusu yeah for sure ukiwa okay, mkenya lazima ujue economic issues tuko in debt mwanze mhm mm, umetu do unatumia kukuja hapa bro si do ulikuwa unatumia kukuja hapa 2 years ago mm-hmm. so unaona hizo vitu zinakuwa affect directly hata uko ignorant aje so yeah me try to keep up as much na mm. mm-hmm. cuz i feel like okay the the like i feel like the kenyan youth personally my personal opinion mm-hmm. is we need to actively participate so in 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 government working as much as to kombali but i feel like we have so much power especially mm-hmm. with us on social media to na influence uko na influence kama msanii Um so to soul wana toa kuna time walitoa song tujiangalie to reflecting around politics mm. i feel like 
um, I would want to know what's, what's your opinion about us um, influential yeah, to us, you influential people, oh, what's that yeah. Nisa? What are you, bro? When you see Pastor Kanza Pale, what the TikTok? I'm going to be team. Pole Pole, bro. My Raman hat, eh? Like, yeah. what, what do you think? Um, when we come at artists, don't you think mm-hmm. you have a responsibility to be like out there and as much as not to condemn, mm-hmm. but to have you as a voice of a few Kenyans who can't speak? Like the way Saudi Soul did with a song, yeah. the way um, Eric Omondi does mm. with his things, his Tasemani critic and all. But what's your take on us having it's, actual responsibility? It, I mean, it's it's. Vilo mesema tu yani ni ni kitu commendable and and na ina ina fa. But tuna pata we artists and or rather influ people of influence tuna go pasa na kuwa critiqued pia. You know, una chita kucheza safe na hiyo issue juu. So una talk to the safe. Utaki opinion yako. <laughs> Utaki kumwaga unga. <laughs> you know? Cuz politics is so divisive as we as you may say. Really, yeah. Okay. Utapata hata you three years into the government but there's still people of the of the other there's no way of working together. Mm-hmm. Mm, so yeah, hiyo ndo ufanya. So I think pia ni politics ya Kenya ifike mahali uh-huh. msanii akiongea kuhusu kitu uh-huh. ataogopa kuzimwa. Okay. Cuz let's say I need my fans I need my fans to listen to my music so I can feed myself and sustain. That's that's what I do. But in the process if I mention something I don't like about a certain politician who is of power uh-huh. and uh, they have my accounts taken away from me. Tashinda kupata hiyo unga. I'm no longer of the voice that I used to be. Hata watu waongeaje what will they do? They want to create a new platform for me to be speaking to them. Yeah, so if the country tells us to get to that point, the the law makers on a fuck for your point yani kuna freedom ya genuine freedom of expression. Mm. Like right now I can say I don't like you and I don't like Collins but yes I'm here we're speaking together. Mm. You know? Mm. Yo, but you know as much as it may look like kuna freedom hakuna bro sio kuna vitu wezi ongea sasa hii na ukue ati bado uko online kesho mtafunga tiktok yangu peke yangu una charge ngi for collabs sasa hii nimeanza ai sasa how much how much for collabs you need to be Relax. Relax. Ni, ni, ni. Kwa kila interview naenda mimi I don't charge for collabs. I don't charge for collabs. <laughs> Niko na hizo phone rings zimekuwa mingi. Wewe watu wana reach out. Nasema hii pesa yote ningekuwa nalipisha si ningekuwa. Yangu ni tofauti. Sasa uko ngana manager atakwa mtasikizana msikieni hapo. Eh, si ni Ethiopian. Mwasikia bado he has said you have to speak to the manager. No 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 no, Asha sema. Ni ni ni. Na but for real big new unit kwa collabs kwanza ni vibe ya ngoma. Okay. Yeah. So kuna ngoma ndio unaweza unaweza vibe nayo sema hata utacharge. Unajua ni venye me link tu na mtu umeelewana na mse. Yeah. Eh yeah. but sahi sahi ju kuna studio course kuna nini unashughulika tu ma logistics kadha. Mm. Mm. Na shughuli na shughuli mm. inatokea. Mm. Na kufollow. Kufollow mse. Ah, yes. Eh, kuna um, wanaza lipsha mtu follow. Sasa like went on Instagram last week and said, mm. Na fuck what took to Instagram and said that she charges $1000. Unasema tu like uni ndovu bro unajua ndovu nani Ethiopia tunaenda naye sawa Miraman hat tulia 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 so kuna wewe kwanza hii topic itakuguza sana nataka tukimaliza as we wind up yeah as we wind up mm-hmm. i want us to talk about um mimi naguzanga tu topics zina trend Kenya churches Mm-hmm. So in the context of churches so we have been seeing Churchill. churches okay, okay. Kanisa, mm-hmm. okay, okay. so we saw Mackenzie Mackenzie come alikuja akitrend vibaya sana and mm-hmm. many people who died through his 
his um, his ministry. Mm. Then there was um, there was Mackenzie. There is Ezekiel, Ezekiel and there is Pastor Nganga, both different contexts. So mm. Ezekiel, Juzi, Ama Nijana, a certain lady. Uh, you saw that post. Yeah, a certain yeah. lady. Mm. Uh, mototo wake alimpiga six mics. Six million. Mm. Akasema yeye haguzi yo pesa. Kwa nini? She, she, the first place, the six million shillings she was going to land was in the altar of Pastor Mackenzie. Ezekiel. Oh, okay. Ezekiel, sorry. So, mm. kuna hiyo context ya Mackenzie, there was, there was so much dead witness there. Then there's this context of um, Ezekiel and now they, they were showing his, his, his wealth. Oh. Like, uliona, space your touch. Juka mama mmekuwa mkimili follow your time. Sasa zake hiyo video story. Ya Ezekiel mmekuwa. Ya Ezekiel. Ezekiel is like kutoka like ni Nairobi bro. It's like it's like a stadium. The the like your place ni big. Ni like I wish that I could just go there. Then there is now um Pastor Nganga. Um juzi tuko na post fly ni wase aki post ni pale post wa mpasho. Alipiga mama flani kofi akamchuja church. Eh hey, ah, niliona hii ni. Niliona. Akamwambia toka uende dale uko nje. Imagine like Mbona ni lady? lady eh? Mbona ni? Ali atia medoza me ile mama ah, amesinzia. Medoza of church. Medoza of church. Eh. Alimwambia toke. Eh yeah, so uh, uh, alimwambia amke. <laughs> Wake up. Wake up. Oh my god. Why do you feel like you my my question to you hey. my question to you there is not a laughing matter imagine oh. nikuje kwanza alikuwa na mgonga hivi <laughs> <laughs> guys that was, that was what, imagine a whole pastor did that me, me personally if it was my mom personally i'm speaking for my i'm speaking in my opinion if that was my mom uh me no will pastor Ikitu. I'm not promoting violence, but there's no way you treat my mom like that. So those are three pastors who are a representation of the the diversity of the religion in Kenya, mm-hmm. of how Pastor Mackenzie led people into. I think it was over 200. Hey, Ama how many hundred? We still don't understand how that. Happened. So many people died, like mass graves. Zawatu wanambiwa. People are being told, um, do not eat. Yet he has women in his kakrib. He was having sex. He was having women to cook, and he's asking his followers not to not to eat. Then we come and see. Personally, for this case of this lady who took um, the six million to church, like I felt it was my opinion. And people, what took a comment section? Let me say that what took a comment section was saying that that's kind of brainwashing. Like if your son gives you six million, why why would you? go to church fast now when you mama mboga literally alipenda reason gani hata alikuwa mbaya john sema ngoe ah mama uko kata kata sukuma niliona and then now you see sasa pastor nganga doing all the theatrics that that come with him as pastor nganga mimi nataka kujua you take on how how much um churches mm. have have gone to different extremes and what like needs to be done in your opinion well i wouldn't i wouldn't blame it on churches yeah mm-hmm. the, the 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 question is influence because mm-hmm. influence and you know dangerous you know like a preacher a preacher didn't choose to have influence so if they tell you bring six million to for me for offering mm-hmm. or plant a seed mm-hmm. and they're selling you hope Uh-huh. and you feel like within you be, they have convinced you to take uh, that's influence you 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 need influence bro I, for me and because i'm thinking about it I, they didn't go and force people to kwa nyumba bring that money to me yeah it's a, same thing i'm an artist i can uh, influence people to come and feel a show they they could stay at their homes like on a netflix uh, man they uh. <coughs> so it's just that the scope of 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 influence is it being used against the law that protects the human rights you know mm-hmm. against the human rights so i can't use my influence to to mess with your health your safety as a human being yeah. uh, you know that if it happened or at least enough for policy it's it's a, it's, a, it's a tricky space because babu hey man because if i have influence let's say <clears throat> even us musicians yeah. i know that, and this is unwise for me to say so but we we can have musicians who who come from a 
from a background ya violence even though yeah, amezaliwa kujua you know uh, <coughs> and then kuna kuna musician personal experience yangu maybe nishaisumbona na polisi sana alafu i'm just singing i don't like cops f the popos you know uh-huh. <laughs> you know if i if i find a cop bro i'm a shoot you down mm. so let's say i have influence i'm going to influence many people to feel the same way and probably even make them act towards it so who will you judge the influencer ama ule mwenye ameenda kufanya action lakini mm-hmm. huyu mwenye ameenda kufanya action ana akili yake ya kufikiria hiyo so ule madhali enda kutuma hiyo 6 million hana akili yake sisi ndio hiyo no no you can't really blame it on the on the person of influence because if you say it and this is yes we have responsibility it, it goes but i can't just tell people just because i'm famous and say it's like you saw the Travis Scott issue you know mm-hmm. you, you can't have millions of crowds and say hey kill each other <laughs> it is like you know it, some people may even do it trust me in this world we live in mm-hmm. you can you can you can get people to uh to a point that the mentality state yao imekuwa confused is like they're in a trance and everything you say bro so people throw stuff at you clothes at you mm. and you're like whoa you know you you say rushi wato sana matoa you don't do that in ethiopia no that's no we don't do that i've seen dogo perform bro but on the real history uh, influence bro okay. if, ni 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 tricky kwa sababu mimi na feel kila mtu anafaa kuwa na responsibility ule mfuko kuwa na influence but you can i can hide myself in the in the books of art i exp- i'm expressing myself unajua eh yeah. it's uh, in yeah that's a deeper conversation for another day yeah mm. but i know most people may take me out of context but if we, if we need to speak about this we can speak about it on okay, different well, day like. Mm. Sema mm. tena kwa wala. Eh. Zii. Yeah. But, but back to my question. I have seen you perform. We were mm. we were tulikuwa na ndovu hey. na nyuki. Eh? Wala. We we entered to, to the society in big club in Nanyuki. Mm. So ndovu ndovu is being introduced, bro. Mm. Eh ndovu anapanda hivi stage. Utanisikiza? Acha ni sema ribia ni mombe ni ilikuwa api na eh. Ulikuwa na mimi kama na ndovu. Wewe sangapi? Relax I give you a trip. Go back to the Ah, yes. Relax. Let's go crazy. Let's go crazy. Sawa, sawa. Mhm. Let us go pay him. Guys, it's a rap. Let's go just does the thing. So ndo anapanda stage. So si amembua eh ni 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 on stage ndo huku. Ndo anapanda stage. Bro, women like women apa chini so the what bouncers apa ju so women apa chini they just they just going wild bro how mm. do you how do you manage no nasema and you're telling mm. us you're single because they don't want you me i was there witnessed women just want to come on stage and do their knees nash like this bro <laughs> how do you manage you could you could see the intention <laughs> from <laughs> from I, I uh, psychology from <laughs> <laughs> that behavior Uh, well, also mm. mm. tu na mziki you know mziki tu hapa na tu mziki they love the music mm. just that eh uh-huh. you want you wanted to say something am i want they just love the music ni mziki tu anapenda <laughs> anyway thank you it's a rap but before today tumalize hiki tu mimi nataka mm. tupige ndovu quick fire quick fire quick fire you choose one of the two okay uh, can i pass <laughs> I was, supposed, I was supposed to have a short up by Tasca. Mm. Ah, that was at the Tasca. I hear Tasca pays its brand ambassadors 16 million a month. Hey. Confirm or deny. I, I wonder. <laughs> 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 Ni ni ko kwa Ni ko this guy when Diamond was coming yeah. we came to Kenya last year mm-hmm. two artists performed yeah no it was one artist who performed before him mm-hmm. and then one Kenyan artist performed after, after. him mm-hmm. guess who was the one artist 
who performed before Diamond Bro. Dove. Say my turn, bro. Dove. Because the stage was this big. Because one obviously ni brand number seven watasca. Bona na ni skuma. So una ni sema kwa mtu ana nguvu. We don't do that here. Anyway. Hey bro, man, I'm going to take this. This all. This is gay show. Anyway, so ndugu pa phone ndo. Ndugu kwa camera ameisha mbaya. Ndugu alipanda stage you are you are you are among uh, you were with major it was you and major. Peke yake hiyo siku ya diamond. Ndio semi major alikuja after diamond. Ah uh, bro, okay major ni come after diamond. Mm. But when in dove atwacha na major bro mm. ukikaa mbuli anza kuimba 2014 si ndio mm. ah si kuimba hata uliingia sapo ndio uliingia fresh into the game mm. 2014 mm. by 2014 major was already doing had had hits true mm. okay okay major ni kona hits mm. my point was ndovu got to that big stage just before diamond got on stage mhm got so of you being a brand ambassador mm. and, and obviously your music has deserved that stage mm. but me i want to know is it true that Tasca and so you and you're the face of Tasca. Mm-hmm. You're the face of he is actually the face of Tasca. He's yeah. going to play humble. Not, not like that, bro. Not I mean. like that. See ya. But we have seen you perform Katar. Yeah, like a 200 keep a man. That's not a 16. Mm-hmm. Uja mana chota kuna kitu kayo 16 million. Uli skia pia story 16 million. Uli skia wapi? I hear he's paid 16 million. I want you to mm-hmm. just confirm. So it's not million. Really... Is it true? Hey. <laughs> I hope it's true but Ninge kuja hapo mngisikia tu 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 Bro Where is the heli pad So they don't pay 16 million Ah uh, but uh, bro uh, I mean that's an inflated number but you know Simba is not too far from mm. the legit. Just number, an estimate. Yeah. I mean there's a fraud kifika But contracts. Like, lakini bro uh, usi, usi, usi fly around na kila kitu inaenda. Well, uh, 16, 16 million. Me I had 16 million like <laughs> ndo bo. Uh. But what well, I mean? Yeah, I mean. But anyway, you're the face of Tasca. Uh more like a brand partner. Mm. Mm. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The Tasca Laga brand, Akiwa Lai. Wala. Mm. Mm. Yeah. 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 Ninge, nikorona, maybe nikieka hapa hapa na ungekuja na gym na piga plain water. Official brand part of Tasca by yeah, that, that was mm. a big move. How long have you worked with Tasca? Well, this is this is one year now. Nikitaka watatukubali. We have um Tasca has how many brands? ABL has Yebi Yebi kuna Tasca iko na Chrome Chrome mm-hmm. Chrome iko na kina Fadamo yes Mhm Voko kwa Tasca peke yako Ai kuna wase wana, wana influence for Tasca bro musician mm-hmm. Another musician Oh Eh yeah. nani Kuna Mutoria Oh Oh no Eh hey, bro dig dig deep <laughs> There's kuna wase But you're the biggest name oh. that I knew. Me and Lidra. I mean <sighs> Ah bro, you na fly around sana. Hiyo ni yako ma 16 million hizo stories. Utaniambia off backstage of camera utaniambia hizo stories ulito wapi? 16 million. Eh eh. So na had too many information with the manager. Ah, ilipo 16 million na. Wana the information with you. Ah, what? I had it for month bro so that's oh, like oh, oh, it's been made by four it's been made by four let me let me pay in a mix how is it cost in dove is not there the 60 million mimi pengine mimi nilipwe pa here this is a big grand bro this is dove bro you know na ibu vijana huko nyuma hey you know about your song sing as your favorite verse ah your favorite line one kwa songs zako zote line yenye besides Okay, ukiimba hiyo nitatisha ingine but mm. line yako yenyewe una feel hiyo ndio uliua. Yaani you have never killed another verse, another line like that one that you like. Uh, ni kada leo subuhi nilikuwa nasikiza verse ya kishash. Mm-hmm. So like hey, hapo uliua. Hapo zilikuwa zilikuwa ze. <laughs> Ile nanga. Nikapuka. Uko idha ku produce. Kutu kutu. Wewe acha bana. <laughs> 
And a bang thing, a wash your name thing. Unaza risk to find you some tasting. Na mini Charlie straightforward, no dating. Semina jua unapenda phone. Eh. So we uno elefante te quiere tu cuerpo, trompeta tocando melodías en tu cuerpo. No, no, Hadija. Hadija with vijana speak Spanish? Can I think? When the mood is right. Ah, yeah. <laughs> you can just the mood. Ah, don't worry about the mood. Yeah, you will I will provide. Ah, <laughs> I will provide. <laughs> I can proceed for you. I shall provide. What about the manager? Don't worry. Whatever. Yo, yo. Yeah. Yeah. Like you need. But if you do zero, I'm just so I met your mom. Anyway, put in by them. So many quick fast. Twenty. Hey you guy. Pass. Hey, you <laughs> How is that a pass though? <laughs> Put in by the to pass. Like preference. Yeah. Like, like quick well, choose one. Me, me just, just choose one. Choose okay, one. Okay, feel quick explain. Put in. Put in. Mm. Uh, kuna... Do I have to explain? <laughs> you want to explain? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> you want to explain? No. Russia, Ukraine. Pass. Yeah. Russia, US. A painting. What was your name? Ting. Dovu. Pass. Um. Niko nengi ni deadly. Kenya. Like acha si pass sa. Nambono na sa. Ronaldo country bili. Ronaldo. Uze Kenya Uganda. Ronaldo Messi. Ronaldo. Oh, sana. Tulia. 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 Nyashinski is out to soul. Drake. Oh, yeah. Nyash, that's out to soul. Mm. Um, mm. Na respect sana Nyash because of Nani. But Nezata have a city litia. So it's all as a group. Bien Nyashinski. 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 Simply because I've worked with BN, but um, say that's my that's the, you have worked with BN. Yeah, but that's the that's my. If you ask me, any any the, my biggest artist in Kenya is BN. So, me say my Julia BN akuna. BN is my biggest artist. Like for you, personal preference. Yeah, yeah BN mm. is like. Yeah, me had to go sana na BN. Then they let you go to music. Yeah, like I. Uh, Why do you think you 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 respect BN? That he much? relates to me sonically. Okay. So much. Sonically. Sonically. Yeah, now I'm being a country to be. As in sound yake, you ni fanya crazy. Yeah, it's like it's like ni Kenya naweza taka kufanya. Ushajisikia kwa muziki. Eh, DNJ ko. Eh. Tulia. Some say. Nicole. Nicole bro. But yo. Nicole bro. Kamla Rizla. Ama ni najuta sema nini? Yeah. 
Ah, our chili kuni agaidia. I need to dig deeper. You need an interview. But <laughs> we have had but na sie ku sitting in Dovu's inbox. Ai. Doctor Kanu utakuwa huko. So you would rather have Netflix with your girl ama mwende dunda. Nita. I don't watch movies by the Is this because you do not have a your girl ama <laughs> Also that makes sense. <laughs> But mimi mse napenda vitu outdoor sana. Mhm. Mm traveling sana. So you drive to Mwende out. Mhm. Wakadinali Brooklyn. Wakadinali. Man Human City. You said mm, Man City. Mm, si ati Brooklyn si wakali ama. If nimekuwa nikisikiza Wakadinali from zamani sana mm. before I knew of Brooklyn boys. So Wakadinali sakaja mhm sakaja mama boy ni eh sax sax mhm okay sakaja majoho sax sakaja maruto eh eh pass okay This this brain of yours works nice. Hai mm. hapo, sasa mwisho wa sani. Major mm. OG. Who's bigger? That was you know. I... Size. Apa? Atoka hapo. Okay, size the one and big. Mocha ni wakubwa size. But yeah, you have you have one has to die. When you find like a labo has to die. Eh, hapana hapana. Pass. Aya, I just say angalia said you sani but mm. who who's okay utasema tu wote wawili the music yao inakubamba because umesema music ya Kenya ama music musically I mean ki, ki aspects zao eh yeah, sasa nitakupea anza kila kitu yeah. aspect yenyewe ni bamba na major ni street credibility na kuwa true to himself you know aspect yenyewe ni bamba na kali ni the <coughs> your aspect ya ku <coughs> kwa risky na ku, ku stick to ground because you know hip hop si genre na sikika na kenya oh. na kufana hadi leo you know so mm, mm. unajua njugush na mkurugenzi eh hey, ai unajua uh, uh, who's your favorite hmm hapo kwa mkurugenzi jo ma documentary zile zake ma story zake like it eh hey, ah. okay. Mm. Um ni muliza njugush. Bajugusha ko ni smart kijana mjanja. Ni smart njugush kijana mjanja. Ni intelligent sana. Yaani anakaga fall like he is very intelligent. Mm-hmm. Mm. So last one last one last one last one last one. If you were supposed to become one thing. Mm. Ah sija kuuliza ass mm. boobs. Then ako sawa hapa hana hapa ama ako sawa hapa hana hapa. Hey, everybody has ass bro so boobs banata ngombe kona boobs come I'm on i <laughs> bro come on everybody has ass <laughs> what is your preference yes. it's not that i mean tukosa ni wewe na umia huko peke yake acha da eh nilikuwa na fight ya mtu but it's okay But I'm going to Ethiopia. Me fanei kaviya do kono chi. You were supposed to get one thing. Mm-hmm. One thing. Genye, you the one thing assuming you're supposed to be granted one gift. Mm-hmm. Or a lifetime. What would it be? One gift for a lifetime. Just to Uh-huh. Hey. Like God I'm going to give you one thing that you ask for right now. Mm. Like just one. Eternal life. Oh. You want to live forever? Yeah. Okay. Mm. You very chapo. Hey, denga. <laughs> Allah. So what's your favorite food? Ugali na nyama na sukuma. 
Na injera. Kuyo ile injera na asema ni muitopia. Kati inje. Kwa nini muje kula injera? Ukiwa ukiwa na dem, ni food gani inaweza mspinia yani aingie box. Food that you would cook for a lady like this and you're sure yo. Unanifanya misiko. Mm, ai. Bro, ina depend Kenya na kula. Mza pala dem fundi. <laughs> Na sipo mtu. Lazima lazima ni nini bro? Napata na fundi jo. Ajali kwenye ajali. Ajali. Ajali kiasi. Let me introduce you guys. So na see who this is. Ndovu ndovu meet fundi. Literally fundi. Anyway global. Sio local ni global. <laughs> at least I'm making new levels. Anyway, it's a wrap guys. Thank you so much for coming. Bless up. Mazemi nimesikia fiti sana ku connect na wewe. Shukran. You are an amazing artist tunaendelea kusukuma. Shukran. Mimi napenda ngoma zako zimi mimi sijuangi utasema nini. One thing I know is kama do the mathematical calculation. Twerk. The one person I had with that was vibes. After that thing I then into mimi ange is when you be is Hey, shukran. Literally, yeah, shukran. I asked for that track from you hivi. Nipe track tu itengeneze dance na kadupo sana. Nilikuwa nataka nilikuwa nataka ku trend. Unajua hii Nairobi kama unataka ku trend. Unaambiwa. Unajua ni na Collins. Unajua ni na Nasiku. Eh. Trend hadi hii Nairobi. Ah, it was. Let me read the other song. Um, mm. My work is to party. Party. Mm. party. Yeah, it was good. So yeah, yeah continue yeah. making good music for Mini us on TikTok. Bless us. Uli msaidia kuandika. Amazing. Was nice. Yeah, I did. They all kept dreaming. Yeah. So, continue making good music for us on TikTok. Bless us. Tunashukuru na Kenyan audience ya muziki. Nime understand, nime come I've learned that you're very very wise. Oh. When in when in when in when in when you see honestly when you unaongea shukran vocabulary you get ah kizungu mingi sikutisha yani kujifanya hapa juu nimekuja mahali kwingine hebu ageuzie camera one kwenye tulipatana hata mimi studio yangu iko kisuru lakini eh kisuru anyway mazia asante for coming god bless you and everything you do moving forward i hope upate msichana siku moja atakupenda amen i pray that you get a woman nasiku amen but just not Okay, let me not just preempt mm. but ukiamua okay, industry maisha yako ya mziki ishe leo bro usi kuski Trust me Ah you go Mimi nakupoga bro Sawa bro Wanza major nifanya ngile siski naambiwa nini mwache siski alikuwa anaimba kila na siye kubagia you try maybe we can change Anyway Thank you guys like. for watching has been an amazing show Bless Co hosted by My son and daughter in law over here always amazing find them on TikTok on his show TikTok in it what Nivo oh. yeah I'm like I'm inspired every day to make bigger strides literally when do we inspire who do we inspire yeah they always have to defend their men na kisha na ruko ku bado kwa ndovu you wonder what they hey, okay, okay 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 no 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 What will you explain? You Guys, are see you in the next one. Church. Adios muchachos. Peace. Bye. Bye. Kumbu unanipiganisha hapa? Anakupiganisha hapa maze. Ah, wewe pia. Unanipiganisha hapa.